Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for around the 11th. So this reading is not sign specific. It may or may not be for you, and it is not time specific. So I mean, it could. It's right around the 11th, okay, of October. So just keep that in mind. We are just going to see what comes up. What do we have? What do we got? What kind of message do I need to deliver at this time? Oh, the Queen of Wands. The Queen of Wands is, this is an exciting opportunity. This is somebody who takes action. This is somebody that is very attractive and creative. Um, strong, resilient, very powerful. Very, very powerful individual right here. Very proud of who she is. This is somebody that is uh, also very seductive. It's a very seductive energy right here. Uh, she has an exciting... This is, this is the Ace of Wands, right? So uh, that is a creative desire. Desire to create something new. This is a visionary. The Queen of Wands is a visionary. She's very, very vibrant, attractive, proud, and determined. Determined to succeed. So we got a very determined individual here. She, somebody may be working on their image, you know, working on improving their image, and it's working. If you are, it's working. Just saying. Mm, eight of Cups. Leaving behind emotional disappointment. Well, somebody's holding their head up high. This is resilient. I saw that. that. This is resilient. This is somebody that is holding their head up high after an emotional disappointment. Seriously, this person has found their strength to leave it behind. Seriously. This is very graceful. This woman is very graceful. Mm, Knight of Cups reversed. Whew, really not focused on a relationship though, or somebody's not, or there's or not not in a relationship. This may be an independent woman. She's thinking about her options. You know, it's like one cup is kind of covered up. I mean, you can see a little bit of it. So I see the seven of cups. So that would be like there's options here. She's thinking about her options and love. But maybe somebody's not coming forward because the knight of cups in, is in reverse. She could be intimidating. This is a very powerful woman. Very powerful. She is strong. She is resilient. She is determined. She is successful. She's a leader. And she knows it. And it's not in a bad way. And it's like she has an exciting new opportunity in her hand. Woo! But I wanted to see what she was looking at. That's why I put it up there. I was like, well, what is she looking at? Because I could see that she was looking out at something. So I decided I was going to put a card up there. So she's looking out. She's looking at uh, some sort of uh, disruption. I mean, that is a tower. That's the tower. Tower is disruption. She sees. This is, this is a visionary. She sees that something is about to crumble. She does. The relationship is about to crumble. It is about to crum crumble. Lightning is about to hit. Somebody's moving. Hmm. This is like this is like a tornado. We see that tornado. It's like something hits, like a tornado has just rolled in, is going to clean the place out. 
It's going to clean something out. And this person knows it. We have a visionary that has seen it coming. And it's coming. And it's going to come quick. And it is going to cause an uproar. And it's going to take out everything in its fucking path. There we go again. I've uh, been swearing a lot lately. Anyhow, the shit is about to, to crumble. Something is about to crumble. Mm. Now, this is a false sense of security. It's a false foundation. It's a structure that is not stable. This could be your body even. And I did see body image. And this is carrying weight. Somebody is working on losing weight, leaving the baggage behind, and it's working, just saying. They may not be focused on a relationship. They're focused on releasing burdens, whether it's actual weight or baggage from the past or something. Somebody is being weighed down. This is the this is a universal change. This is too much to carry. We have to get rid of it for you. It has to go. You can't you can't do this anymore. You got to leave it behind. This is this is a new adventure. It's time for you to go. Just just go for it. Just go. It's time for you to go. This person has seen it coming. It is coming. It's coming. Disruption is coming because somebody has been holding on to something for who knows what reason, and this is too much. You can't, you can't hold it. It's got to go. It's got to go. Mm. Queen of Cups reversed. Now, oh. sorry. Queen of Cups reversed. This is going to be emotional. Okay? It's going to be emotional. It's going to... You, it may, you know, when you have to let go of something that you have been holding on to for a really long time, it's emotional. It is emotional. Be prepared for some sort of light to be shed on a situation which is going to cause a structure or a foundation that wasn't stable, wasn't solid, wasn't secure to collapse right here. And this collapse is going to, it's going to hurt, okay? The Queen of Cups is going to make you emotional. It may make you cry. You may see yourself as a victim. You may, you may, uh want to retreat okay this is this is the universe coming in to remove something from your life that you have been holding on to that is weighing you down and it's not helping you and somebody has been in some sort of illusionary state of mind holding on to it and the universe says this isn't uh stable okay it's false it's a false sense of security i know you want to hold on to it but you can't going to be emotional. It's an emotional change that is driven by the universe. We could be dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, for sure. Or an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Somebody is walking away. Somebody is saying goodbye. A relationship, it's like a relationship is going to crumble. I can't make it up. It is what it is. Oh, God, ties are going to be severed. This is severing ties. It's a lose-lose situation. There's going to be a conflict. This could even be some sort of crisis or argument that starts, okay? There's definitely going to be some tension. 
and somebody is walking away. You got to hear somebody's walking away. And I don't think the other person is going to stop them because the other person just wants to win and doesn't care. This person is heartless, heartless. But we have somebody here that is very strong and determined to succeed. This person is uh, evolved. Oh my goodness. Ooh, no chance. There's no chance that this is going to work out. The judgment reversed. Somebody hasn't been telling the truth. Hmm. Ooh. Unaware. This is unaware. That this is a blessing. And this is a blessing in disguise. This is a blessing in disguise. This is a blessing in disguise. It is. You may, and this person may be unaware they may be unaware that letting this person go is going to bring them something better than they ever imagined. <laughs> Whew. Queen of Swords reversed. This is very upset. Not definitely unaware. Somebody is definitely going to be unaware and upset. Pissed off. Very. This is karma and this is bitch. So, hmm, what the hell is this? Somebody is leaving and it's karma. This is karma. So here's another karma is a bitch reading. I mean, it is, it is part of it. Yes, karma, karma bitch. So we do have, we do have, but this is a blessing because somebody is going to receive something better. Okay, that is the truth. Ooh, somebody's gonna, you know, uh, there's a breakup here. There, somebody could even have a heart attack. I don't know. Sorry. Why those words came out, I do not know. It's a very emotional time. Something is about to, to eru erupt. This is like, an, it's gonna, it's gonna explode. And I think that some sort of ties are going to be severed. Somebody is going to feel the pain of it. There's definitely going to be a painful separation here. This is a painful change. It's like a collapse. Somebody could actually collapse. And oh, I don't know. I just felt like, you know what? I just, I don't even know. It's like, I, you know, it's, please God, I don't like to deliver these kinds of messages. But something about holding your heart. Oh, man, I can't be dealing with this shit. Please. Oh, God. I don't know whose message that is, but... Mm. being Somebody is being left behind. Being gone. Just being left behind, okay? This is, this is definitely going to be... There's going to be some tension. You know, and this could be tension around your heart. I'm telling you, I, I don't like this at all. I really don't want to be talking about this. So, um... <clears throat> seeing the light, going their own way, going down a new path. It's time to refocus. It's time to go within. It's time to... Uh, reflect. So it is going to be a time of reflection and isolation. Somebody may need to, to just be alone, to just go and, you know, be alone because of some sort of pain 
that they are going to experience. Okay, this is going to be painful. This is the, the karma that is happening right now in the universe. I'm telling you what, this is what's going on. It's definitely going to be an upset. It is going absolutely going to be an upset. And there's no chance of coming back. There's no chance of reconciliation here. There isn't. Once this person goes, it's over. It's done. There's it's, that's what's going on here. It's like it's done. This is heartbreaking, heart pain. Somebody is saying goodbye. They really are. Could be, I don't know if it's an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, or could be a Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer. There's definitely some sort of uh, severing of ties where somebody is being left behind, probably without saying much of a goodbye. Not saying much of a goodbye, okay? Or not. This is no goodbye here and no goodbye here. It's like I'm just ghosting. This is ghosting. It's, it's, it really is. No communication. Just leaving without communicating. It's the end of a relationship. That's what this is. And it could be, so, it's very sudden. This is sudden. It happens quick really quick and it's very emotional um, it's like it's somebody is gonna need to take to take a step back and focus and and be still with what has just happened because it's like all of a sudden this tornado came in and wiped some but something out it's like whew, gone end of a relationship there is an end of a relationship here <laughs> I can't it is I mean I everybody knows what that means we have somebody here that is finding their force within them To leave behind a emotionally disappointing lose-lose situation that has made them bitter. It has made them uh, upset. Somebody is finding their strength. They're finding their strength to, 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 let, it, to, to let it go. And whoever they are dealing with is going to be very emotional that this has happened. It's not realistic. There's no satisfaction there. There's no more growth. Somebody, somebody has um, been really dissatisfied. And it's like, there's, there's no reason for me to stay. There's no reason for me to stay here anymore. I'm done thinking about it. I'm finding those, that force within me. I'm finding the resources to take action. And when the magician finds the resources and uses the resources that any resource that, that he can use or find to bring success and, and that includes um, the divine source it includes um, shedding the old that he sheds the old to bring in the new so I feel like we have somebody here that um, is is willing to do whatever it takes to bring success and whatever it takes in this case means no longer investing in a situation 
that isn't love, that isn't happy. I can't make it up. I'd like to, but it's not who I am. And it's like, and I really, I feel like heaven is here. This is as above, so below, and this is a card of heaven. So, I'm not sure how that resonates, but it feels like this really is a blessing. It's a blessing in disguise. This is power. Very powerful. Somebody's definitely giving up. They are giving up on a situation that has no success. Because they know that they have the resources to be successful someplace else. They know that they can be successful someplace else. So I feel like today is going to be a day of somebody uh, getting some sort of rude awakening. That tower is a rude awakening. Something is going to be waped out. And I mean waped out. Like, <laughs> done. Absolutely done. Let's get an angel romance card. There's no victory and success. There's no more moving forward. And somebody is finding their resources to take action and walk away. Whatever it is. They're walking away from something. And, it, and it's, a re very, it's not emotionally fulfilling at all. Whatever they're walking away from, it's like, I know. It's this, this person. I feel like this person knows, sees that this has to crumble. So that they can start over. And it is about to crumble. Somebody's foundation is about to be... <laughs> demolished. Make the effort. Great love is worth taking the steps you are guided to take. And here we go. Somebody's going after great love. Because whatever they've been holding on to is false. See ya. Good luck. <laughs>